Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for clicking on this video. Y'all can see I'm in the raw right now. No eyebrows done, nothing. I'm here in my hometown, Panama City, Florida, in a hotel room. My family is gonna start rushing me in a little bit, but I just want to do this really quick video for y'all. As you can see from the title, this is gonna be about finding your target audience. So today I'm gonna share a few questions to ask yourself that will help you narrow down who your target audience is. If this video is helpful for you. Please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Leave me a comment, share with a friend who also might find it helpful. Hit that subscribe button, turn on the bell notification so you know when I post. Let's get into it y'all. Like I said, this video is gonna be kind of rushed. It's very impromptu. These are gonna be things that I would ask myself off the top of my head. So get your notepad, <laughs> get your notebook, get your pen. It's okay if you don't know the answers to these questions right away. It takes time, but just give yourself a break. Be, be gentle with yourself. Number one, the first question I'll ask myself is how old is my customer? And it's kind of tricky because if you know your customer, it's probably within the ages of 25 to 34. I don't believe you should, oh, y'all heard that? I don't believe you should put too much focus on the age because you could have someone outside of your age range who would also enjoy your product. Have an idea of who your age group is, but also don't just limit yourself to that age group, if that makes sense. Two, where does your customer probably live? This is super important. Say you are a clothing boutique, you can't sell big fur coats to people in Florida unless they're extra like me and still buy them for pictures. But realistically, like most of your customers, if they are Florida based, are not gonna buy a fur coat right now or ever, probably, unless they're going on vacation. Number three, what kind of jobs do they probably work? Are they making $50,000 a year? Or are they making more than that? Or are they making less than that? This is also super important because it's gonna tie into how you set up your prices. Number four, are they college educated? This is also gonna help you narrow down who you're actually speaking to. Number five, what do they do for fun? This is gonna be questions like, do they stay home more or do they go out? Do they go to brunch with their friends on the weekend? Are they shopping? Ask yourself, what would my customer be doing on a typical weekend? Number six, what kind of music do they listen to? And you may not think this ties in, but trust me, if you know what kind of music someone listens to, it helps you a lot as far as setting up ads, setting up marketing material. Don't just limit yourself to the type of music also think about the artists. I recently read something and it made me think about that too. If they listen to R&B, do they listen to Usher, Bryson Tiller? Think about all of those things. Seven, what kind of food do they eat? Do they order more takeout? Are they cooking more at home? Do they eat fish? Are they vegetarian? Are they, the list goes on really. I mean, there's so many different dietary things, but what kind of food do they eat is another question you can ask when you're forming your target customer. All right, y'all, that is it. Those are the seven questions I would start with. There's obviously a lot more that I could go into, but like I said, I'm rushing. If you do wanna see another video where I go more in depth, please let me know. I'm gonna give y'all a really good starting point, so take your time to answer these questions. If video was helpful for you, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Leave me a comment, share with a friend who's also trying to find their target audience and doesn't know where to start. Hit that subscribe button, turn on the bell notification so you know when I post. Thank y'all so much for watching. I'm wishing you much success in all of your businesses. I will talk to y'all soon. Bye.